This is MPG's coolest bunkhouse. This is a 2024 MPG 2800 QB. They've, uh, they've stepped up their game on their exterior as well. We got a nice outdoor camp kitchen here. Pull out on this sucker, we got a big old countertop space. And then we got this like cast iron griddle. Cook up some mean steaks out here, some mean steaks. Uh, and then to the, to the left of that, we got the mini fridge. Those other models we put in the mini fridge right above the grill. Stupid place to put it, for burn your arm. We also got a leash latch back here, bring the doggies along, holds up to 1,500 pounds, so bring, bring a couple doggies if you want. While you're cooking up some gourmet salmon on a nice summer's eve, you can blast your favorite tunes on these outdoor speakers here. That thing is underlit with an LED strip too, pretty sick. Safely housed underneath your big old beefy awning. There's a mount for a ladder as well as a mount for a backup camera. It's not installed yet, but you can add one. Spare toyer right in the back. We got some stabilizer jacks down below to keep the rocking at bay. Let's check out the inside of this sucker though. Check out that bunkhouse. Ooh, wowie zowie, that is a nice living area. I won't keep you waiting for that bunkhouse though. We'll go back there first. Get through this door. Holy guacamole. Holy guacamole, that's a nice looking bunkhouse. It's perfect for two to four kids because we can convert this uh, sweet boot dinette back here into another bed. Wow, that's awesome. Now we got uh, one, two, three, four beds for four friends. What's the deal with that, MPG? What's the deal with that? Or maybe you just don't bring a fourth friend. It's cooler as a little dinette anyways. It's like a little train car or something. It's like you're riding a little train. Um, this bed is also optional. You can, you can latch it right up. You can set up a TV right here if you want to set up some video games. Got the, got the power, USB, USB-C. Back up to the living area. Um, booth dinette here. So we got, we got two dinettes. Kids can eat separately. This one's got some nice big windows, great views, beautiful views, spectacular. Uh, that sucker and that sucker, both of those can be converted into sleeping. Got the Sansui TV in here, Furion soundbar below that. Kitchen area, pretty standard, pretty basic. But we got uh, actually, okay, not basic, because this is an air fryer here, air fryer oven. Not basic, I take it back. Three burner gas stove, undermount sink. Uh, nice microwave, solid microwave. Solid refrigerator as well, travel lock. Built down to that sucker. Uh, the bathroom, the bathroom, there's only one of them. Decent bathroom though, nothing crazy. Standing shower with a skylight. Finally we'll head up into the bedroom, the main bedroom. We got two doors into this thing because it is tight quarters in here. It's nice for each person to have their own door to get in. Otherwise pretty standard. Nice big old beefy king bed here. We got we got some USB-C, USB ports, some regular outlets as well on either side. Let me know if you got any questions on this sweet uh, bunkhouse. The phone number is in the bio.